right so welcome back to the work in progress video of the fridge night so um, I'm gonna be recording separate videos then compiling them together and what I'm gonna be doing right now is just following the steps so right now I'm at step one which is the body and what I would like to do or what I already did is just cut out the pieces on one step one one row and then uh, proceed to build them uh, downwards and continue the process so on and so forth so I've already cut the, the parts for the first row and I'm gonna show you me building it so um, uh, but I think it's gonna be quick cuts. So uh, when I'm done with one portion of of a row, for example, let's say I'm done with this row, then I'll show you how that it's done. If I don't do that, it'll be and show you the whole building process. It's gonna be, it's gonna take a very long time. And I don't have, I don't believe my audience nor me have the patience. Or I do have, do I have the patience to actually look through the whole video footage and see which part is okay or not. So so the first part for the body is this few parts and what you see is magic from here to here and as you can see I already completed the first row for the body. So I will now move on to the second row which comprises of this parts like so and all of this can be then transformed into this the main body section and i really like to say it's a very simple build yet it feels quite sturdy uh, you can see uh, some of the mechanisms that are in, that are involved and it's a really really nice uh, simple kit to build so uh, i'll close I will move on to the head portion. The completion of the body, I'll move on to the head. And as you can see, these are the few parts that comprise the the head. Uh, you need to actually put a sticker for the C1 piece. Like so. And yes, I'm going to be putting stickers instead of painting. Because I'm a lazy fuck. But yeah. So like so. And then you're gonna assemble all of these pieces. So let's see if I can do the whole head thing um, quickly enough. So let me see. This is the parts here. With the D1. Oh, no wonder. I cannot believe I forgot that piece. And you put this piece into that thing. To put into that piece. To put into thing uh, let's see if I can do this right now right here right now in camera so this is step one step two is you, you put it put those pieces there now step three you put the this this piece on top of the other piece uh, see like 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 so yeah like so now you got that piece over onto that piece and this is what you should look like for this piece <sighs> and then you put that c c one to one the piece on top of the piece and then after that you're not done because you want to put the b13 piece on top of the other piece you know to 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 put the to secure the hoses like so and then when you're done with that put the a19 set the a19 piece behind the head like so and once you're done with that you're not done yet because you want to be putting the a1 20 10 piece yeah the 10 piece the 10 piece what yeah you want to be putting this piece over this piece right here or something Let's see if I can oh this is the wrong side yeah, like so so put the, the the horn on to the head piece and please do not cut this little horn piece put it into that hole be careful about the whole building process because some of these parts are small and you don't want to break any of them would you huh so so, so get it get it get it get it 
like so once you're done with this you put the whole head piece on top of the the low head piece and boom voila you're done with the if knight's head which i believe you can connect it to the body like so so the head and the body very nice looking bust of the if knight and let's move on so i'm going to be following the same style of uh, video video recording slash video editing for the body i'm not going to build the whole thing as you can see why it took me three minutes and 35 and counting for the head itself so continue with uh, the next part on the instructions we go from the head and the body to its feet and as you can see i have the parts for its feet right now and i and a part of the instructions calls for the stickers as you can see right here over here these two stickers seven and six and from now on the pace of the video is going to be much more faster um, to, to, to clearly show the reason why you go from here you go from to this and from this to these feet pieces so from now on we'll move on to its legs this part comprises of the the joint part for the uh, knees for the legs and it comes with uh, it contains various c parts and it also compare comprises of a various b parts b1 and b2 and you will notice there are brackets there this is because they are asking you to build two sets so you don't have to uh, they do so they don't have to print out more paper um, so over here we can turn from all of this into into the top part of the legs and the joint part for the knees and to continue on from this to the leg parts the lower leg parts more uh, to be more specific and uh, i have already cut out the parts for them and if you want to know these are the parts of the instruction so now they'll go from this into into all of this so um in the, the inclusion of these parts over here we come to these parts over here and the, at this point the, the instructions pretty much tell you to actually put all the parts together so for example like this put these pieces together like uh, like so uh, here then you put the feet together with the uh, let's just shove it in there make sure you it's nicely connected ah uh, like so and now you're, you're left with the joint pieces which have uh, the following pieces these pieces over here and when they are done you could put the pieces onto the legs itself so for the right side of the leg put it in and for the left side of the leg oof, put it in nice clicks and here we are completely done with the legs and now we'll move on to the waist these are the pieces that are needed and from here it changes into into this uh, i've run over here to put the legs in because the instructions have, have told me to do so and from this part we have to cut up more parts to put it into the waist okay i'm back and these are the parts that are needed for the waist and backpack apparently and putting this i already went ahead and put the stickers on it and and man those stickers are a pain in the ass to actually put it on uh, so I'll be put I'll changing I'll be fixing all this up and the next part will be shown so yeah I'm now done with the waist parts and the head the body and the legs and as you can see tubing that goes all the way to the backpack is also done so now we'll move on to the arms Alright, next we move on to the 
arms then but first we we start with the shoulders first and these are the parts that we need for the shoulder joints as well as the armor uh, this is the part of the instructions that i'm referring to so all this will now magically turn into in to this and i realize now i should cut more parts to build more parts of the arms and all of this all of this will be turned into these and oh wait i i forgot the fist oh shit all right so there we are much much more better and we can now proceed to put the arms onto the waist on the torso what what the hell like so really really nice looking figure that's gonna be coming up and now i should put the armaments and the weapons so the next part will be that in case you were wondering what part i was at i was at this page Oh, I forgot to put that. Shit. Much, much more better. Well, making the weapons are uh, should be simple. Should be simple enough. It's just putting these pieces with these pieces and putting all of these pieces together. Um, I believe there's another two extra pieces, which are the clear translucent pieces that connect to a separate beam or heat dagger uh, holder or sheath oh wait sorry handle so i'll come back to that okay so um very quickly i will turn all of this into into all of these and as you can see it's a really nice looking model kit and well action figure when you're complete uh, the colors are all there uh, well a bit um with stickers but uh, also but this is a very simple kit to build uh, i have some problems with it um, but i'll come to that when i go to the when i get to the review so stay tuned for that thank you all for watching this work in progress video and well have a good day